this is the best season of your life so far. Amen. I don't care what the lockdown is saying. This is the best season of your life. We are going to take this communion right now. And the communion is going to be the communication of the revelations of this season. Everything we say this season represents communicated via the communion. Secondly, the communion is strength for the journey. Strength for the journey of the month of May. In 1 Kings chapter 19 verse 7, the angel of the Lord gave Elijah the type of the communion in the Old Testament. And the angel of the Lord. And the angel of the Lord came again the second time and touched him and said, Arise and eat because the journey is too great for you. Arise and eat because the journey is too great for you. For the journey of the rest of the month, the journey that will see us through to the end of the COVID affliction, for the journey of this rest of the month, we are going to receive strength and we are going to receive his help and his mercy in the precious name of Jesus Christ. Lift up your communion as we begin to pray upon it. Father, we receive this newness of strength every single thing that has been preached today communicated into the lives of your children the freshness of grace the freshness of mercy the freshness of victory the purification we are asking for illumination and revelation by the power of the communion we are asking for strength and health through this communion for the month supernatural supply we are asking for an explosion of giftings and potentials and talents. We are asking, O oh Lord, for the fire of the altar to move to another dimension. We are asking, O oh Lord, for an activation of the ministry of angels. We are asking for high spiritual sensitivity and perception. We are asking, O oh God, that you step us into the possession of our possession by this coming. And then, above all, strength for the journey. Strength for the journey. We receive it in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. And I declare today, by this communion, a clearer understanding of the season be released upon you. I, a, the grace to pray endlessly yeah, and pray the changes into being. That grace is released upon you. The grace to put forth appropriate actions to see appropriate results be released upon you in the name of Jesus. And I declare in your life no carryover. Everything you experience, the Pharaoh you saw in the month of April, you shall not see in this month of May. I take authority over kidney disease. I take authority over urinary system disease, over diabetes, hypertension, over peptic ulcer disease, migraine, over, over, over upper respiratory tract infection, chest infections, everything that is not of God, prostate, everything, disease of the lungs, disease of the liver, disease of the prostate, disease, disease, disease of the breast. I curse you to your roots by this communion. Receive health and receive strength in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy ghost say a louder amen by your blood oh lord by your blood, oh Lord, 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 you set the captives free, oh Lord, by your blood, oh Lord. You set the captives free. Thank you, thank you for the blood. Thank you for the blood. Lord, thank you for the blood. Lord, I thank you for the blood. Lord, I thank you for the blood. 
Lord, I thank you for the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, Lord, Lord, I thank you for the blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the blood. So I thank you for the blood. Lord, I thank you for the blood. Lord, I thank you for the blood. Lord, I thank you for the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, Lord, Lord, I thank you. Father, we love you. We thank you for the blood. We worship you for the blood. We appreciate you for the blood. To you be all the glory and all the honor in Jesus' precious name. I see healings taking place already. Miracles, signs, and wonders. And I see that this month is your month in Jesus' name.